I think incident response is well defined um, prior to cyber. So uh, the not the business disruptions of the day were natural disasters or server outages and memory leaks or what have you. Uh, for the very first time, you have watchers. Um, incident response in the cyberspace is completely different. Uh, it is uh, from the get go. It, you know your threat actors are trying to undermine it. If wait, wait, let's, wait, wait, let's back up here. We oh. have to define. We have to define threat actor. Okay. Oh. So, okay. so You're um, yeah, go ahead. yeah. Oftentimes the hacker, right? But in cybersecurity parlance, right? The reason we call threat actor actor instead of attacker or or um, criminal or hacker, um, it's a it's got a technical definition, right? And and a threat actor is um, it's it it could be a cyber crime gang. It could be an individual in a door room. I understand it could be lightning, um, any f external force that can create a loss, right? Um, but you're using that in the general term of, yeah. hey, there's people out there that mean us harm, right? You got it. So um, these people that mean us harm, these threat actors, they're in, they're 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 in the business of of causing that harm, or they ha they have intent to cause harm, and and there's an incident, right? Um, presumably in incident management, the organization that's being attacked knows there's an incident and they've raised their hand and said, okay, it's incident time. We're going to start our process or we're going to initiate our process. We're going to contact our whoever. 